You're tracking your calories in your steps, lifting four to five times a week, but the scale is still not moving. That's because fat loss isn't just math, it's really hormones. There are three hormones that quietly control your progress. And if you don't keep those in control, that calorie deficit that you're trying to hit on a day-to-day -day basis honestly becomes a non-factor. Number one, insulin. When insulin is high, your body goes into storage mode. Every snack, every sugar you drink spikes it. Balance your blood sugar and you can unlock fat loss again. Number two, cortisol. Chronic stress, poor sleep regimen, or even if you're a caffeine junkie, you're spiking your cortisol. You're telling your body to hold on to fat, especially around the stomach area, even if you're in a caloric deficit. Number three, ghrelin. That's why when you don't sleep enough or you cut your carbs to zero, crash diet, uh, dropping your calorie deficit by 1500 to 2000, whatever it may be, greenland skyrockets. When you don't sleep enough or you crash diet, that's why in these instances, often you feel like you're starving and you're craving junk food as that's your body's way of fighting back. So yes, I admit calories do matter, but your hormones decide what exactly your body does with them. And watch how your hormones work for you and not against you. Get enough sleep, eat a balanced diet, get 10 K steps a day, manage your stress. All of these things will help your metabolism start working for you as your greatest running mate rather than against you as your worst enemy.